Well, vacation ended early. Is it for you? Oh, you're so sweet. Well, hey, you're my girlfriend now, so there is nothing I wouldn't do for you. Now give Papa some sh... <laughs> Ladies. It's girls' night out. Oh. But hey, you should come. If you like dancing. Dancing? You ain't even seen dancing. Until you've, you've seen, seen funky, funky Ricky. I think he's hungry. You could call me oh, turn him off. Ricky, you're acting really weird. <laughs> what are you talking <gasps> about? We're gonna back on. Souls. It's only brought them a bunch of no's Yet they try the steady push To get noticed, to get a look But that's just fine, maybe luck All of this to make a December A December So sorry, ma'am. Call me Julia. Yeah, it makes me feel old. Yes, ma'am. Julia. What happened? I just made a uh, fantastic first impression on Julia, Bill Tanner's wife. Perfect. In some cultures, knocking a person to the floor like that would be seen as a sign of great respect. Pretty sure you just made that up. <laughs> Maybe. Brady, Kate, Kate, Brady. It's nice to meet you. Excuse me, Kate. He's ready for me now. Okay, thank you. So, I'll see you Friday night. And I dig the boots. It was good to meet you. You already said that. I got under control. I'm just thinking. Thinking about what? Thinking that my wingman should have told me you were staying there. <laughs> Kate's here. <clears throat> <laughs> I thought I could wait all night for you to come and say hello, or I could take matters into my own hands. Uh, um. This is Andrea. Hi. Chris Harper. Apparently, Hi. I can't be trusted around beautiful ladies. Or pudding, come to think of it. Pudding? <laughs> it's uh, what's that about? <laughs> smooth, like me. So, mostly I was thinking that you look amazing tonight. But, dude, she is very strong. Don't be mad at Chris. I made him do it. Why would you do that? Because you asking, no, you telling me not to come, it was unreasonable. Well, here you are. Welcome to the Hilton. How are you? Uh, I, I'm getting used to this. I mean, it's not for everybody. Well, everybody in here. But you know what I mean. Brady, you're gonna have to do better than that. I don't think so. No, this is hard for you. It's hard for us, too. For a smart girl, that was a really stupid thing to say. Wow. Did you hear what I just said? I watched two men kill a guy. Ten feet away from me.
I told you not to come. What, what, what were you hoping for? Well, I wanted to see you. I, I wanted you to know that you're not alone. Alone? I'm definitely not alone. I've got what? 1,200 other guys right here. Go home, Kate. I know that I don't understand what this is like for you. I am not stupid, and I am not unaffected. Um, What is this? It's an invitation. If you want it. Find me a job and the rest of this history. And you've never been back. No. Yesterday was the first time I'd seen him since I was invited to leave the ranch. But it's better this way. How is this better? Are you kidding me? I, I've never had it so good. Look, look where I am. Look who I'm with. Not to mention I have a fantastic job. Not in the prison system. Brady. You lost your family. Now you're losing the chance to be the man I know you are. You can't waste your life over the things you wish hadn't happened. The thing is, Kate, we like to think we have this godlike understanding of the way things should be. <laughs> we really don't. I know this. I've been through exactly what I needed to go through to be right here with you. Right. When I was six years old, my dad died. I didn't. And life went on, and things were fine. But I would give anything just to have one day with him. And I cannot understand choosing not to. Kate, I, d I didn't choose this. Look, I'm, I'm making the best of things. No. This is better. This first, we love because he first loved us. Is this how Jesus loved you? What is this? Like seriously, why am I here? I could not care less about this portfolio. And one day you say that out loud and oh, now it's a performance improvement plan and a probationary review cycle and every conversation is about what did you accomplish today? And what are your stretch goals? And don't forget, our bonus is based on my review of you at the end of the year, so how do you think that's going, Heath? And so you start over analyzing every investment review you send to Stella. Every piece of work, every comment made, why did she close the door? Why did she look at me like that? What are they talking about down the hall? Was it about me? Approximately, we'd been working together. Um, the incident actually happened shortly before we met. Yeah. And so had heard the story. We were good friends at that point. And who, who came up with the idea? I think we should write a musical. So, <laughs> so, um, I was driving in the car one day. I had just recently experienced my own tragedy in my family uh, related to mental illness and was really processing through what that meant for my family going forward and was listening to Lisa's album that she had written a number of years earlier called Music in the Sky and uh, one song that she wrote in particular about her brother called Jamie 
and I could just see it on a stage. I just imagined this happening and I thought Lisa's an incredible storyteller. I like to write. We love to tell stories. I'd been doing that for some time and so why not tell the world. We thought it's a story that needs to be heard and we hope it will be received well. And after people hear about the story or they've seen it or they've read it, even our cast members, suddenly dialogue is coming mm -hmm. out. I can see myself in that character. Oh my goodness, this is my nephew. Mm -hmm. I want to do something different. I want to do better or um, wow, someone else has gone through the same thing that I have gone through. YouTube videos and you just have such great chemistry. It doesn't mean you always agree on <laughs> stuff, but let's go ahead and roll this clip. I'm Lisa. I'm Meg. And we wrote Boy on Billboard, the musical. Yeah. <laughs> We're we are Boy on, on Billboard. No. <laughs> and we are. And we are Boy, and and we we are are boy on Billboard. Okay. And we are. Where's the emphasis? And, and we, we are, are. And boy, we are Boy, boy on, on Billboard. billboard. Lisa and I have actually been working together for quite a number of years now. Most of our projects that we have collaborated on uh, were for work and related to education and our job. Some of them were really fun, some were more uh, intentional and serious. And so um, we already knew we worked really well together. I think, or I thought we worked really well together. We did. Um, we do. We, we've always really worked worked really well together. Um, I think that we have fun when we're mm -hmm. working, we enjoy collaboration, and it was a really natural transition from working on work to something that we wanted to do mm -hmm. and um, something that we wanted to do for ourselves as artists creatively. Mm -hmm. um, it was really natural. Yeah. And I mean, it hasn't been without like knock down, drag out, like it's like <laughs> we're sisters. <laughs> 